I have put together some of my favorite exercises to help tone your muscles, lean them out, make them hard, and help you look the best you can. So I hope you enjoy. Let's get into it. These two exercises are meant to be paired together. They're both for your core. They both take a little bit of coordination, a lot of focus, but makes a big difference when it comes to your stomach muscles. So getting right into it, we're going to start with the straddle crunch. Lying back. Both your feet extended, your feet are flexed and energy reaching through your heels is very important. If you work on your hamstring flexibility, this will help you. Then your arms are vertical, fingers reaching, and what happens is the sensation has to start from your behind your belly button, pulling towards your spine, curling up and through, and you have this little mini straddle that happens as you reach through your legs and gently down. I care about the weight up as well as the weight down. Do not crunch and throw yourself back. Nice and controlled and back. Exhaling like blowing out of a straw. Nice and steady, even tempo. And you should feel a, just a tremendous burning going all the way through. Now, the sister exercise this is the midline crunch. Same concept, same position, except we start in the straddle now. My hands are behind my head, supporting my neck. And I want you to create a little bit of pressure into your head as well as your hands into your head. Now we've got support for your neck. And what's going to happen is, I call it a midline crunch because you're going to come towards your center, your feet are going to come to your center, all to that midline, and down. Here, lift, lift, and down. Everything's coming in, everything's controlled down. These are the exercises. It's important to pair these back to back because the first one starts to really work your upper abs, and then the second one, that midline crunch, gets you right here and into your pelvic floor. Huge for us ladies. So one thing that may come up if you're extending your legs, you're like, I'm just not getting there. If you don't have the strength to keep them up, this is the exercise you're working towards, all you need to do is bend them. Give me that nice 90 degree angle. You can use this in your straddle curls, just like this, as well as the midline, starting crunching in and back. Just because your legs aren't fully extended doesn't take away from the ab work. Start where you can start and build from there. 